This is a Navy F-4 from Point Magoo, California, equipped with a GPS navigation and bombing system. Flying 1,000 feet above the ground at 450 knots, he starts a 4G pull-up and tosses a 500-pound bomb at a tank nearly two miles away. and scores a near bullseye. These tests were made in August 1981 at Nellis Air Force Base, Nevada. Sixteen bombs were dropped during four sorties. Two sorties were flown by a tactical air command pilot. On the other two sorties, a TAC F-4 flew alongside the GPS F-4. The TAC F-4 carries a paved TAC pod, which includes a forward-looking infrared system, or FLIR. This is FLIR imagery of the bomb run. The GPS set measures range and Doppler along the line of sight from four Navstar satellites to compute highly accurate position and velocity. The GPS data is used to update an inertial platform. All that is needed is target position, latitude, longitude, and elevation. With that input, GPS will navigate to the release point in any weather, day or night, and do it passively. Since target acquisition is not required, the crew can stay on the deck until release, and a first pass delivery is assured. Bomb scoring was provided by triangulation from two remote TV cameras. The image at the top of your screen is from a camera to the east. At the bottom is the view from the north. Overall scores for these tests are classified. However, system accuracy data may be obtained from the GPS Joint Program Office in Los Angeles. The GPS Program Office is grateful to the 57th Fighter Weapons Wing and the 422nd Fighter Weapons Squadron for their support in these tests. 